Alright. I got on tonight. You know, I haven't been seen or heard from for a while. Yeah, I know. But, of course, I looked at Low Bucks and a couple others. And I saw where Low Buck was having a one year giveaway that I almost missed. I say almost missed because once I watched the videos, um, I realized I need to be back here. I need to be with like minded people. And I need to get my directions reset. So he said that there's been too much negativity. I guess that I am glad I missed it. I just really didn't need that extra negativity in my life. Things are starting to get on the straightaway, so. Um let's start with it. Let's start with Lobuck. I like Lobuck. He's just so funny. Harley style. And uh Miss Lobuck, uh, sometimes I don't know how you do it. Lovebug seems like a handful, but he makes me laugh, and that's a good thing. Alright, Misty. Misty just doesn't, I don't know, nothing seems to get her down or upset her. She lives a life that I, I would love to have. Um, I don't know that I could do all the work that she does, but I'd uh, sure like to give it a try. And she's always upbeat. Alright, this is I still working. She's just got this perky little voice that just makes y'all ready to go. Um, I've just learned so much from, from these people. Lobuck, Misty, I'm still working, Cat's Cradle. Um, I kind of got a kick out of this one because she just kind of let everybody have it. Uh, you know, and, and put it where, you know, don't be scared to do something. Don't listen to things that people that don't do this don't know anything about. I mean, there's some things that you need to listen to when you're doing canon, you know, uh, opinions and then make your own opinion. But I see a lot of things that they say can't be done. I, I see it done here. And, um, you know, everybody else show their fails too, which makes it kind of good. So... We know if maybe their way wasn't quite right, and a lot of times they can tell you what they did wrong. I'm lucky, I guess. I've not seen a bad side of this other than trolls, and most of the time they're kind of laughable. Either picking on the people that we know are good, um, wannabes maybe. But I'm glad that I got into this community. I'm glad I got to know the people that I do know here. East Coast Prepper. Oh my goodness, I just adore him. Um, he's... I want to say he's one in a million, but... Uh, he's got the heart of gold. He don't care what nobody thinks. He'll tell us what he's got to share. And, you know, he'll give you a hand if you need it. You know, if you ask him a question, he's always there. Uh, Bex, uh, Bear... Bear Prepper, love her too. Her cat's cradle have really got me going on on a lot of the stuff. I I truly watch their videos and rewatch them. She chef, yep, she's a effort prepper. He says things that most of us only think. But but congrats on your year. I hope you get at least another year in there. Um, honestly, I'm gonna submit this, but. I don't care if we win or lose. Well, nobody really loses here. But the fact that I turned into your page today and found this and it kind of got me refocused. It it reminded me where I should be and why I came here. And um, I agree to pass on the negativity. Let it go elsewhere we don't need it we have focus and we have reasons for what we do and uh, all of them be sitting on the outside when we're sitting on the inside with food and water and shelter and who knows what else we'll have I don't think the ones that are prepping now are going to do without a whole lot alright guys I promise I'm back this time I'm making 
I'm going to make a prickly pear jelly this weekend. I promise I will do it. Alright, guys. I'm out of here. Great going, Lubbock. Bye.